Hello everyone and welcome to Friday. Today is the day, back at the very beginning of January, when I first went to the doctor and she gave me the look over and we talked and everything. She said, it's probably a stomach ulcer. We're not, you know, you, you don't want to rush into something like a CAT scan because that will be expensive and possibly for no reason. Which, you know, at the time was fine. It's just now in hindsight, I'm like, ah, no. Anyway, now three and a half months, almost four months later, we're here. It's time to, uh, it's time to get checked. Three months later, time's hard. Uh, I'm gonna be getting a CAT scan today to focus on my abdomen and figure out what's been going on. As a very quick reminder, I've been having uh, abdominal issues since uh, probably late October. Uh, originally thought it was stress. I mean, I guess I could still maybe be stressed, but I originally thought it was stress because Mal was getting ready to have surgery and I was freaked out about it a little bit. Um, and then we thought it was a stomach ulcer, which now we have tested for that, um, and that doesn't seem to be it. Uh, my body does respond to the dicyclamine and the pantoprazole that they have me on, so like that's helping do something. But I'm hoping for a CAT scan to just finally get some clarity on what on earth is going on inside my body because I've been in pain for six months. Uh, so we'll, you know, hopefully we'll find that out today. The other thing, and I don't remember if I mentioned this, is that uh, we did the stool study and the results of that came back negative. I know I mentioned it on breakfast stream. I couldn't remember if I mentioned it on the vlog. So just so it's out there, uh, my stool is fine. It's clearly not, Jesus Christ. But there's no bacteria inflammation or you know anything like that. And so that's good. Uh, well, you know, CAT scan is, uh, it, it actually the scheduling stuff for the CAT scan really sucks. I have to get here at 1245 which will be on time. And then my actual CAT scan's not for two hours, so I have to drink contrast whenever I arrive. And then I also am getting intravenous contrast. Uh, I've had intravenous contrast multiple times. I've never had to drink contrast, so that's gonna be new. Uh, we'll see how that goes. Uh, but the actual CAT scan should be, should be cake. I've had several in my life, so it'll be fine. It's just, it's gonna, t it's gonna take a lot. It's, it's gonna, you know, this is, this is kind of a full day affair, and I'm not sure how I'm gonna feel afterwards, which is not great because Kirby comes out today, and we're gonna be playing Kirby on Twitch tonight, but uh, it is what it is, man. I've, I've needed this CAT scan. I asked to see if they could move it up, and they couldn't, so I've actually been waiting on this for several weeks, and I'm just ready to get it done and ready to try and get some results, and figure out what the heck is going on in my body. <laughs> about half? Uh, I guess. That's about half, okay. So, I can't eat, but Mal can, and obviously she needs to eat because, like, it's 1.30. So, uh, fortunately, there's uh, a place to get something to eat, like, just up the road. So, we went and got a little bike for Mal, um, and uh, I'm just kind of chill. So, I'm in a weird spot. This, I can talk a little more freely now that I'm not worrying about uh, disrupting a, a, a lobby. Um, I drink half of this now or a little bit ago. And then I drank the other half, basically about an hour from whenever I drank it. So I have to drink the rest of this, the other half, in about half an hour or something. Um, as you may have suspected, it's gross. Uh, they gave it to me when I got here, and it is, it is room temp, and it is very thick. Um, 
and it, it's very hard to get down. Like my plan had been that I was going to just chug it and you, you can't you can't. I, I wanted to so badly. I was like, I'm going to just chug this. And I got started and I was like, oh my God, I can't do it. I can't do it. So, um, so that's where I'm at is, uh, I'm just waiting 30 minutes, 25 minutes. And then I chug the re well, drink the rest and, uh, you know, try not to puke. How's your sandwich? Good. It looks good. I want a sandwich. <laughs> I can't have a sandwich. It's over. What time is it? 3.30, 3.30. Um, I mean, the actual, like, CAT scan portion is, like, quick and, and, and easy. Um, weirdest thing is always the contrast. And it, you know, it was weird. Um, I tried to really focus on it this time. I was like, I really want to like feel where it's going. And you know, that, I think that's the strange thing is that you, you have this warm sensation, but it's not like all over your entire body immediately. Like you feel it traveling through your body. So, um, you know, it starts in your arm and then I felt it in my throat. My throat got really warm and your whole body feels warm. It feels like even your breath is hot. And I felt it traveling through my body and the weirdest place this might be TMI, but I just think it's funny. The weirdest place that I felt, you know, after my throat, that I felt it like really, really hot was my, uh, my backside. Why? I don't know, but I mean, that's what it felt like. Oh, that was quick and easy. I didn't just had to drop it off. Weren't there two in there that you had to? No, I left those at home. I thought we'd mail them with the paintings. Oh, okay. All right. Yeah. Um, so. As an update now, um, we, now that we finished, Mal had to drop off her prints, so we just did at a, a post office. This is not our normal post office, but a post office. I can eat now, so I got freaking Jimmy John's. Very excited. I am ready to eat. I have not had food. And the other thing is I need to be sure that I'm drinking a ton of water today because you have to flush all that crap out of you. Yeah. So I'm gonna eat this sandwich, and then what? We're gonna go pick up Kerbo. Let's go pick up Kerbo, and get bubble tea. Oh yeah, we were gonna get bubble tea like weeks ago, and we didn't. <laughs> because of Pokemon. <laughs> yeah, there was one of the one of the prompts for Gengar. Yeah. Was that Gengar drinks bubble tea, and we were like, oh man, that sounds good. And then artists, you know, are constantly making art of it, and I'm like, oh, we should get bubble tea. And then we actually were down by it and forgot. And now we're down by it again, and we're not gonna forget. But first, I need to eat this sandwich. I'm ready for this. I'm even. I'm even wearing my Kerbo shirt today. Kerbo shirt. I'm wearing the. I'm wearing I don't the shirt. Have a Kerbo shirt. You don't? No. We will. We will shirt. fix this for you. I promise. Target's got this little stand up, which is nice. They also got Animal Crossing cards, and they want you to buy a Meta Knight amiibo. That's okay, I just need the game, thanks. Well, we did it. We got bubble tea. Have we ever gotten bubble tea from this place? Nope, Lindsay did though. Okay. I didn't know what to get. I haven't had bubble tea in years and years and years. And uh, we were looking at the flavors and I was like, oh, coffee, that would be good. And I just stared at her like, really? After today, after what I'm currently associating coffee with? The other flavor, by the way, that they had was berries. My options were macchiato and berries. And I was like, mm, don't know about berries. It's good to have this again. Mm -hmm. to, to, to like try it. I like mine. It's fine. It's fine. It's kind of how I feel about it. It's like, it's fine. I think there's other sweet things that I would rather have but like it's not bad by any means it's just I don't I don't think that this is something I would probably go out of my way for again mm -hmm. I would I know but the thing is I want to know that I don't want to go out of my way for it <laughs> and it's been a few years so it's time to like have another one but if I was with some people and they were all getting these I'd get one okay let's go home 
I can oh, eat it. It's a... Open. I hate this. Open. Open. In a circle. Oh, we. Oh, that was a hidden one. That was a hidden one. Aren't you glad you did that? Wait, wait, wait. Can you jump inside me? Nintendo, come on, patch this in. A few hours later, and man, Kirby is good. We just finished the stream, and um, it's just a re it's just a fun game to play. Uh, I've been seeing reviews come out in the past few days, I guess because the embargo lifted, and uh, a lot of folks have been saying that it's it's a great Kirby game. Metacritic has it ranked as like the second highest Kirby game uh, on the site. And I get it after playing it for a little bit tonight. Um, we, were, we actually played quite a bit. We played a few, uh, few hours of it. And um, it's, it is both familiar, but also with novelty, which is, yeah, it tends to be what makes something successful. Um, it is Kirby, but there's so much new stuff. I mean, first off, you're in complete three dimensions, which is enjoyable. It actually works just fine. Uh, there's a bunch of new character designs. Um, and there's some interesting stuff with some, uh, like the ability to upgrade uh, your abilities, um, where you're like working on a you're working on a town for Waddle D, and you get coins, but the coins actually do help you because you can buy power ups for the abilities. So then when you when you get an ability in the field, it's actually stronger than it would be otherwise. It was fun. It was fun, and I was a little worried about the co-op mode because I was worried that it was going to feel a little like an afterthought and it's not as bad as I thought but it is definitely something that feels slightly tacked on not in a terrible way but notable a little bit um, the camera always follows Kirby uh, the the player two can only play as uh, bandana waddle D um, which, you know, limits the moveset a little bit because Kirby is about being able to experience all these different abilities. I don't really understand why they don't just allow a second Kirby. There is historically multiple Kirbys. There's yellow Kirby. I, I don't know why they do that, but it's fine. Um, and there's some levels that are very strictly single player. They're kind of like these little extra things, but you do have to do them. They don't take long to do, but you have to do them. Mal and I solved this by just swapping um, that came at chat's recommendation after we did the first episode, everyone was like, yeah, why don't you guys swap? And I think it was the right call because, um, I, I don't want to say that the game is objectively more fun as Kirby, but it's certainly more interesting, you know? So the game will be fine single player and as a co-op game, I think it's very fun. Um, I think if you're looking for a good, like casual couch co-op game, and especially if you already like Kirby games, like you absolutely should give this a shot. It, it was really enjoyable. We also picked it up at Target because we were in the area to go to Target. And Target had a, like, whatever, bonus thing? Is that what they call these? It's not a pre- It's not a pre-order bonus. No. It's just a purchase bonus. And it's this little zipper pouch. A little Kirby zipper pouch. And on the back it says... Kirby in the Forgotten Land zip pouch, promotional use only, not for resale. That's cute. Anyway, Kirby's fun. So now we are going to, uh, we actually never, so we had lunch pretty late, or I did, because I couldn't eat anything until after I was out of the appointment. And um, we're having dinner now, so we're just gonna do a little soup, a little, uh, little sandwich, a little uh, grilled cheese. And then we'll be heading to bed. I feel all right. I feel all right. Um, obviously, the beginning of this day was a little rough. Uh, and it was never bad. It was just, you know, who wants to go through all this crap? Um, but my evening certainly turned around because it was a lot of fun to play Kirby. And it was a lot of fun. It's always fun to stream. Um, but now that I'm done and, like, the the excitement high of doing a stream has worn, worn off. Now I'm like, whew, I, I did go through a lot. I had to have all that crap done, so. Drink more water. I gotta keep drinking water. I'll probably sleep really good tonight. Thanks for watching. Let's meet back tomorrow, shall we?